folks have written a song about the River Tay. This is kind of like a, a rough version of it. <laughs> Yes, indeed. Good morning, everybody. Guess where I'm going this morning? It is about 25 to 11, and I'm off to the Mental Dental. Yes, it's my regular monthly trip to go and get my teeth cleaned. I'm at the Mental Dental, get my teeth sorted. Mental Dental, get the nice and clean. Mental Dental, get my teeth sorted. Mental Dental, you know what I mean. a spiss card here today in the bridge subway. Bridge level. There we go, spiss card. All right folks, here we are then heading towards the old mental dental. There's the old Tetris building. Absolutely starving folks. I had nothing to eat. Don't like to have something to eat before I go to the dentist because you know, but sticking your teeth and hulk around and put out a bit of toast or something, you know, so. So after we've finished at the dentist, we're going to go and do something. Don't know what. My mouth will probably be really numbed up again. So I think all I'm getting done is get my teeth, the bottom quadrant cleaned this time. So we'll, well, we'll see what happens anyway. So, And the dentist, the girl that I get, Rebecca, she's really, really nice. So uh, it always feels like a bit of a waste of a day though going to the dentist, you know. Hey ho. Folks, there we go, that's me out of the old mental dental now. A sad one there because it's the last time I will see um, the dental nurse who saw me there, Rebecca, and it was very nice she was. But um, oh, it was a right tussle with the back tooth there, man, until I got the, the calculus and the plaque of it, man. But there, that's it done. So I have to go back on the 29th of May, uh, I think it's another Monday or something. Anyway, right, we're off to see what we can find to do now.
Right, folks, we're not at Asda today, we're at Tesco. Yes, indeed, right. I need potatoes, carrots, side of the carrots. I need a couple of ales, um, broccoli, I think, as well. And something, of course, for me to eat now, because I'm starving. Fancy something like a, a sticky donut. Yes. So that's where I was, folks, right there on the third floor. Good old mental dinner. Well, once again, Tesco manages to annoy me. Walked all the way into from the car to the uh, the coffee machine in the garage there, and it's not working. It took me great delight, or it took them great delight to say it's not working, sir. Surely just a little sign on the coffee cup to say not working today would have sufficed to save me a, a 30 second journey. Guess where I am, folks. Have a guess where I am. We're back at the picnic spot. Yes, indeed. Right, folks, we have indeed returned to Jags Rock picnic area where not only are we having a coffee and one of these fantastic vanilla, there's a woman looking at me there, vanilla bun things. Similarly, on Jags Rock, there is a plaque that says the Big Rock. So that's what it's named, the Big Rock, similarly, officially. So we're going to go down and see if we can actually see the, uh, the Big Rock plaque. So, folks, there it is. Jags Rock, although it is apparently called the Big Rock and has been here since time began. I just when I thought I was getting the place to myself. Still, I don't think I'm going to head down to the rock though, so it should be okay. So why are we back here then, Jag? Well, we're here because I was watching a thing called Newport on Tay, not on TV. It's a YouTube channel. And the guy was down here, and seemingly there's a plaque on this rock that says it's called the Big Rock. So let's have a little scout about, see if we can find this, this plaque. So unfortunately, I can't find any plaque at all, folks. Had a good look around it. You would have thought if there was a plaque telling you about the stone or the rock, it would be in a prominent position, but I can't just see it anywhere, so never mind. I'll, uh, I'll try and find a photograph online of it and put it here for you, hopefully. So in the meantime, a bit of a fail there at Jags Rock today, I'm afraid. Right, folks, I'm actually on the other rock here now. This is the kind of the small rock. There's the big rock or Jags rock, just right there. But I came down to this one just in case I made a mistake and it was this one, but it's not. So we are still clueless about the plaque here. We have to ask Matty, uh, see if he knows what's happened to the plaque. It looks like it's probably just been removed, I would think. I found myself here at this little sort of fishing area but the guy was quite strict and said don't be taking photographs of anybody or anything so I'm just going to do a little bit of filming here. What a lovely little area it is though. It's obviously here for, for fishing. I think you need a permit to come here and fish but we'll just have a little walk around. I've got to be careful for people casting uh, as well. There's an old thing up here though I want to take a photograph of. We'll see how we get on folks. Oh, it helps us up there. 
Right folks, we're back home. We're in Spiz HQ. So I spent the last 20 minutes there sitting and talking away to this chap who uh, came up and started speaking to me at the fishing lock and telling me all about what happened to the fishing lock and stuff. And turns out he knows a couple of people I know. Um, he's their neighbour. I mean, just goes to show, eh? Weird. So that kind of sport my quiet sitting around there moment. Anyway, that's it for just now, folks. But stay tuned for Jag Lives later on where we have invented a fidget spinner toy with magnets. Yes, indeed. I'll give you a quick glimpse of it right now. This is all you're going to get until you see it later on. There it is. See ya. Fun with magnets and bearings later on, folks. Bye for now.